Hi everyone, welcome to GT Coding. In this video, we're gonna create a contact form for our WordPress website. We have already installed a plugin called Contact Form 7 in one of our previous videos. If you haven't installed it, you can go to plugins, click on add new and search for Contact Form 7. So after you have installed, you will get a tab called Contact. So go ahead and uh, click on add new so this is a contact form first of all we'll name our contact form and here we have different things that we can edit so here we have a text field for our name and email subject and things like that we can also make changes to the titles and uh, we can also change this text over here I'll just leave it as it is and uh, then if you go to mail, we have different options over here. So in the to field, you have to set the mail ID where you want to send the email. And in the from field, you can uh, add your own email ID or the email ID from your website. And then you can set the subject and uh, message body and so on. And then you also have a tab called messages where you can customize uh, the messages for different situations. So after you have done all these things, just click on save. And here we can see our contact form has been saved. And we have this short code over here. Now what you need to do is copy this code from here and paste it in the contact page. So we don't have a contact page right now. So we'll just add one. And we'll type contact over here. And uh, here we will type some message. and we'll paste the short code over here and then we'll click on publish and our contact form has been published we'll just view our page so here we can see our contact form so now let's go ahead and style our contact form so here in our style.css file we'll create a new comment so we have different classes for contact form if you go to and if I right click over here and uh, click on inspect so here we can see we have different classes for our contact form. So we're going to apply styles to these different classes. So first of all, we'll type WPCF7 input and WPCF7 text area. And we'll type box sizing to border box width of 100% margin of 0 padding of 0 and 16 pixels height of 42 pixels and uh, then for the text area we will give it a height of 100 pixels now we'll go to our website and see whether we have the desired changes so here we have our contact form and uh, we have this button over here now we have a problem over here that the sidebar is not being displayed. So let's go to our uh, page.php file. And if you go down here, we need to change this to dynamic sidebar. And uh, here we'll give the name of our sidebar. So now here we can see our sidebar. Now the thing with contact form 7 is that it sometimes doesn't work with a local setup so you may have to install it on your web server and if it doesn't work on your web server as well then you can install a plugin called uh, easy wp smtp just search for easy wp smtp and click on install now and then click on activate now just go to the settings and uh, here you can fill in these details you can visit this uh, documentation for more details here they have provided all the details for filling uh, this form right here after filling all this info you can go over here to test email and check whether it is working so now I will show you a demo from my website so this is my website gtcoding.net and uh, this is the plugin easy wp smtp I have set up everything according to the documentation and uh, for the two, I have set an email 
test at gtcalling.net and for the subject we will have gtcalling contact message text and here we will type some message so now we will click on send test email if we open the mail and if we click on inbox here we can see we have the email and if I click on that and we can see that the email is actually being sent we'll just send one more email and uh, we'll click on send test email we'll go to our mail and uh, in our inbox here we can see we have the new email hello123 so that's basically how you create a contact form for your wordpress website so if you have any doubts you can ask in the comments below and if you like this video please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel to get the latest updates thanks a lot for watching have a nice day